And we are ready to go. Our officiating crew, Gary Maxwell, Jeb Hartness, Paul Zelk. And from T-Mobile Center, it's the Illini in orange, Cincinnati in white. Davenport, who's been their leading scorer, averaging 13 points a game, has missed his first two shots. Coburn goes up off the glass. And there's the first points of the game. And it comes to Coburn. Kept alive by Maxwell in the corner. Seven to shoot. Maxwell. Uh oh. Wow! And Coburn slams it home. And he asked different team members, what are you grateful for today? I think it's a great way to start practice. What are you grateful for today, especially in today's day and age? Driving lay in there. Mike Saunders off the bench for Cincinnati. By the way, 4 0, as I mentioned. To start his career as the head coach at Cincinnati. Nice pass underneath. Locken was able to adjust that shot. Now Saunders diving. Great hustle. Bodies everywhere. Boy, this defensive group has been effective for West Miller. The depth off the bench, a defensive depth charge, and Curbelo finally gets free. Just a tremendous gentleman and coach, and also a roadie for Vince Gill during the summer, by the way. You gotta nice. love that. Shot clock's down to four. Curbelo, three. Got wow! Curbelo hits his first three of the season. Bearcats off to a one for six start from the field, and there's a turnover for the Illini. They're second now, turned right back. Number four for Cincinnati. And oh! One. Curbelo acrobatic. He'll go to the line and try to complete the three point play. His shoulder, get to the rim and make plays. Steve Nash like. Yeah, flex him. Go ahead and flex him. You deserve it, Andre. I have hit 6 of 11 from the field. Oh, There's the man. left hand and Coburn. Grandison got a hand on it. Lockett able to get it back across. Lockett trying to step around Coburn and banks it in. Now Lockett's got a chance to be really, really good. His first bucket. Underneath Coburn. He's already in double digit scoring with 10. Just watch Coburn when the ball goes up. Coburn gets around Cobal. That was too easy. Savvy. I love it. Well, with Io DeSumbu going to the NBA, a lot on Curbelo's plate. That's an important basket right there for Madsen in Cincinnati. A miss by Plummer. Cincinnati forces it quickly ahead. Saunders driving and got it. Love that. How do you attack the rim before Kofi Coburn gets back? Lockett almost traveled. Good screen. To Julius to step back. Good. Adu sets the screen on Curbelo. Adams Wood started to attack, but was deterred by Payne. Now Adu and Payne down low. Curbelo got a hand in there. Adu with the right hand. Nice play. As the bigger Hawkins on him, gave it up. Well, I'm a playing with two fouls. Three! Huge shot for Cincinnati. Gets it within two. And I saw a 15-point lead cut down to two. Uh oh Hawkins saw an open lane. He does what he does so well with that flush. Saunders three. And Curbelo. Technical foul. Quick move. Oh, what a move by the 6'11 sophomore Victor Lockett. They would have it here, but that three missed by Koval. Lockin. Oh! Third opportunity. And Cincinnati has their first lead of this game with 2.10 to play in the half. Yeah, I'm going to get into vampire bats later on, baby. <laughs> Just wait. Curbelo. That's a long two. Got it. Back settles. In front. He settles this team, doesn't he? He does indeed. Three, Davenport, bam, swish. What a start for the Bearcats. I don't want to blame the entire state of Arkansas, but it looked like, based on the hats they were wearing, they're Arkansas fans. Adams Woods, a miss. Davenport trying to clean it up, it does. And after a little bit of a rough start, Jeremiah Davenport. He was waving for it. Feeding Coburn, a do down low. They can't stop Kofi there. It's first bucket of the second half. He has 16. Really good on-ball defense by Curbelo. 
Newman gets in the lane with the left hand, kisses it in. Adams Woods, left hand, no. I do offensive rebound. Back, Davenport launches a three. Boom. You know, Cincinnati's just played harder. After the first run of this game, Cincinnati has played a lot harder, just tougher. <laughs> you know, Wes Miller, 4 and 0 to start his career at Cincinnati. Tay Baker was the last coach to do that back in the mid 60s. He always keeps defenders playing defense. Adams Woods gets it to go with that left hand. Second but, bucket tonight for Micah Adams Woods. Julius on Curbelo shoots over him and scores. All off the bench tonight. Five to shoot. Davenport. He's got the ball in his hands. That's a long three. Boom! Getting it in the hands of Coburn would probably go a long way in an Illinois rivalry uh, return in this game. He just bullied his way to the basket yep. right there. And as I was trying to say, if Illinois is going to rally, that's going to go through Coburn. But Cincinnati just keeps making shots. Now, how you do that, I don't know. I'm not smart enough. But Wes Miller is, and that's all that matters. Though I've not heard Wes Miller say, aw, shucks, at any point. That's true. That bounces in for the freshman R.J. Melendez, his first basket tonight. It was really, really good. But, man, I, I love that 2005 version under Bruce Weber, who will see Bruce here in the second, in the second game tonight. Not a lot of time, just over four minutes to go. There's Manson. Do with an exclamation point. And Hersey Hawkins is the reason why. I mean, his, his jersey hangs from the rafters. The arena in downtown Peoria, just a tremendous offensive weapon. Lockett with the follow-up. 14th ranked Illinois. He's just killing people inside. Oh, Lockett, nice block. Initially by Hutcherson. Been that kind of night for Illinois. Fourth, fifth opportunity. No. That that possession right there yep. is Illinois' night That's in a exactly nutshell. Right. Outside the first six minutes of the game, seven minutes or so. Career high 20 points for Saunders. He and several of the starters come out. We get Sam Martin in the game, a walk on. Jared Hensley is now in. Obama, though, with the basket. We'll see them on ESPN2 tomorrow night in the championship game of the Hall of Fame Classic. That is a stretch of 18 consecutive three-point misses. Cincinnati, a 20-point win tonight in Kansas City. They move to the championship game tomorrow night against either Arkansas or Kansas State. Cincinnati is what...